so you rub your hand over it like this it don't really leave you have to take your finger and kind of scour it that don't really want to come off at all brand new fresh cut pine 20 inch in diameter log brand new blade and it's waving and dipping like crazy. All the way through the board. You can see right here, pretty good. You can see right there, it gets wide as hell. Back down to nothing. Just a fresh cut pine board. This is the way the, the sawdust looks when you move it. That's the way it looks. Take your finger or cigarette lighter or whatever and make it move. I see y'all, uh, the first time we've cut it not, we're going through blades like crazy. I don't see any contact with any metal in my gauges But I see sparks coming from this area from time to time. I traded the old sawmill and got rid of it because I could not stop it from waving and because I used blades like crazy. As a matter of fact, the scrap iron guy just left with a five by 10 utility trailer full of blades. Never resharpened them, bought them new and now a new sawmill is probably worse than the uh, original one I had, but this is the way the sawdust looks. Tell me what's going on. So, last week I called, last Friday afternoon, couldn't get it to run properly throttle cable nut was off and it was running a lot lower rpms than it should now it, it's vibrating so bad hardware is falling off of it i didn't buy an in what i thought was an inferior sawmill that won't line up hard as hell to get this to close. You have to get a screwdriver to put the blade back on it. And I thought I could cut pine. Fresh cut. I'm running the debarker. The logs have been up off the dirt except for when they were cut and or either blown down at the heart of the tree slabbed off and I'm fighting this battle 